நாராயணம் நமஸ்கிருத்த நரஞ்சித நரோத்தமம் தேவீம் சரஸ்வதீம் வாச்சம் தத்தோ ஜெய முதீரயே ஜிதந்தே புண்டரீகாட்ச நமஸ்தே விஸ்வபாவன நமஸ்தேஸ்து ஹிஷிகேஷ மகாபுருஷ பூர்வஜ சதக்ஷரம் பிரம்ம ஏ ஈஸ்வரஃப் குமான் குணோர்மி சிருஷ்டி ஸ்திதி கால சல்லய பிரதான புத்தியாதி ஜகத் பிரபஞ்சசூஹு சனோஸ்து விஷ்ணுர் மதி பூதி முக்தி குணசாமியே ததஸ்தன் பிரதக் பும்சி வியவஸ்திதே காலஸ்வரூபம் தத் விஷ்ணோஹோ மைத்ரேய பரிவர்த்ததே ததஸ்தத் பரம் பிரம் பரமாத்மா ஜகன்மயூத்தேஷாத்மா பரமேஸ்வர பிரதானம் புருஷஞ்சாபி பிரவிஷ ஆத்மேச்சையா ஹரி குரோபயாமாச சம்பிராப்தே சர்க்காலே வியய அவ்வயோ சிருஷ்டி மைத்ரேய சாரி டு மைத்ரேய பராசர ஸ்டார்ட்ஸ் டிஸ்கிரைபிங் தி சிருஷ்டி பிரக்கிரமம் சோ குணசாமியே பிரதமம் து பரமாத்மா ஆசீத் தென் யூ ஹாவ் ஃப்ரம் த பரமாத்மா பிரதானம் அண்ட் புருஷா போத் ஆஃப் தென் கேம் அவுட் ஃப்ரம் த பரமாத்மா சோ நோ யூ ஹாவ் த்ரீ என்டிட்டிஸ் பரமாத்மா இஸ் பிரம் ஜெகன்மய அட் த சேம் டைம் ஈவன் தோ ஹீ சீம்ஸ் செப்பரேட் பட் ஹீ ஹேஸ் பர்வேடட் தி என்டயர் வேர்ல்ட் அண்ட் பிரதானம் அண்ட் த ஜீவா ஆல்சோ சோ தேர் ஆர் த்ரீ ஐட்டம்ஸ் நோ பிரம்மன் ஜகத் ஆர் ஜகத் காரணம் தூ அத்திர பிரதானம் அண்ட் ஜீவ திஸ் ட்ரையாட் ஆர் திஸ் ட்ரையாங்கிள் இஸ் வாட் எவ்ரிபடி ட்ரைஸ் டு ஃபைண்ட் அவுட் த ரிலேஷன்ஷிப் அண்ட் வேதாந்தா ட்ரைஸ் டு கிவ் யூ த ரிலேஷன்ஷிப் பிட்வீன் பிரம்ம ஜீவன் அண்ட் ஜகத் சோ ஹியர் த த்ரீ என்டிட்டிஸ் ஆர் பிரதானம் புருஷம் அண்ட் புருஷா அண்ட் பிரம்ம ஆர் ஹரி பிகாஸ் வி ஆர் ஸ்டடிங் விஷ்ணு புராணம் வி டாக் ஆஃப் ஹரி ஆஸ் தி அல்டிமேட் ரியாலிட்டி ஹியர் பிரதானம் புருஷன் சாப்பி பிரவிஷ்ய ஆத்ம இச்சையா ஹரி குரோபயாமாச சர்க்காலே சோ வென் த சிருஷ்டி ஹேஸ் டு ஹேப்பன் டியூரிங் தட் டைம் ஹரி என்டர்ஸ் இன் டு போத் பிரதான அண்ட் புருஷ டு கிவ் தெம் த சித்வம் சித்வரூபம் இன் ஆர்டர் ஃபார் சிருஷ்டி டு ஹேப்பன் சோ பாகவதம் கேட்டவாளுக்கு திஸ் வில் பி தேர்ட் டைம் ரெபிடேஷன் ஏன்னா த சிருஷ்டி கிரமம் ஹியர் ஹேஸ் பின் எக்ஸ்பிளைன்ட் இன் பாகவதம் ட்வைஸ் ஆல்ரெடி once in the second second skandham and once in the third skandham now we just finished uh, it will be another repetition for you all here so yatha sannidhi matrena gandha kshobhaya jayate manasah na upakartrutvat tatha asau parameshwarah parameshwarah athava harihi katham kshobhayamasa in the earlier shloka we finished with the krobhaya masa samprapte sarga kale sarga kale pra samprapte sati when the time of creation had uh, occurred hari hi uh, uh, vyaya avyayo krobhaya masa vyaya uh, uh, pradhanam maya and avyaya is purushah or jeeva he he uh, acts as a catalyst or he abusing kalam as a swarupam he acts as a catalyst and he tries to agitate the two in order to uh, create the world right now katham kshobhayamas so what is his actual agitation here in and the mattu kada era madri illa that's not uh, uh, the uh, role of parameshwara here yatha sannidhi matrena gandhah kshobhaya jayate gandhah a sense of smell any smell that is Uh, in the air it immediately prompts a, a small uh, let's say a, a sanchalam in our mind sannidhi matrena just by the presence gandha smell krobhaya jayate it causes agitation uh, sannidhi matrena manasah na upakartrutvat it does not help the mind to do anything there gandha is just a presence it does not come in and uh, uh, take the mind towards the object or anything it is it's uh, its mere presence makes the mind do a lot of things na upakartrutvat upakarta ityukte tatra it does not act like an upadana karanam or it does not hand hold the mind to all the objects that are related to the gandha gandha is present no matter what if a person does not have that sense of smell he is not going to understand or he is not going to be prompted into action either mentally or physically but a person who understands that gandha by the mere presence of that gandha that smell he his mind can travel to many places uh, we don't know tatha eva asau parameshwarah api this ishwara harihi also by this mere presence பூர பிர பிரதான புருஷயோ தோபா ஜாயத்தை 
there is an agitation in the sense the sarga kriya starts he again further describes parameshwara as sayeva kshobhakaha brahman kshobhyascha purushottamaha saha sankocha vikasabhyam pradhanatve api cha sthitah vikasa vikasha ubhayor api uh, um, it both are correct here um, so by, by when we take the example of gandha we might think that vishnu is only a nimitta karana sannidhi matrena gandha eva krobhaya jayate ityukte tatra gandha vidyate nimitta rupena just as how a kulala or a potter is present there with his stick and he is trying to rotate the chakra he has nothing to do with that pot he is completely distinct from the pot that is created from that chakra so he becomes the the potter becomes the nimitta karana in the same manner here also when you take the example of gandha you might think that parameshwara is just a nimitta karana no here in order to negate that he says sayeva kshobhakah kshobhakah ityukte nimitta karanam his presence is needed there but at the same time his other two forms are pradhanam and purusha so he becomes the kshobhyah also and the resultant karyam from the pradhanam the srishti happens which is the jagat srishti hi tatra jagad roopam api parameshwarah eva saha sankocha vikasabhyam pradhanatve api saha eva sthitah saha purushottamah eva sthitah he is uh, present as a pradhana in both the pradhana's sankocha state and its vikasa state pradhanam or prakriti or maya parameshwaraha eva harihi eva pradhanatve api sthitah sa eva pradhanataya api vartate vidyate he is spoken of as the prakriti also prakriti can be of two types now one is it can be in its sankocha state collapsed state which is the adi mula prakriti mula avidya or guna samyam sankocha ha ityukte guna samyam gunanam samya avastha yada vartate tada srishti hi na bhavati when all three gunas sattva rajas tamas all three gunas are in its equilibrium there is no srishti which is your mula avidya which is the pradhanam so sankocha avasthayam ಪ್ರಧಾನತ್ವೇನ ಪರಮೇಶ್ವರ ಸ್ಥಿತ ವಿಕಾಸ ವಿಕಾಸ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಡ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ವಿಕಾಸ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ಸ್ ವೆನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಅಸಾಮ್ಯಂ ಇನ್ ದ ಗುಣ ಗುಣೇಶು ಯದ ಉಚ್ಚ ಉಚ್ಚ ನೀಚತ್ವ ಭವತಿ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ಷೋಭ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅನ್ ಅಜಿಟೇಷನ್ ದೆನ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅನ್ ಇನ್ ಈಕ್ವಿಲಿಬ್ರಿಯಂ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಗುಣಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ there is an up and down of the gunas and you will find the srishti happening because each object will have either sattva more of sattva or more of rajas or more of tamas when there is an extra of sattvam then your devatas are produced when there is an extra of rajas there is activity then your indriyas are produced when there is tamas more of tamas then the objects of the world are produced so when the, there is an inequality of the gunas which is your vikasa then the spread or the uh, uh, creation of the entire world with its vichitra roopam happens so tatra api pradhanam eva mula karanam jagat srishtehe jagatah vikasa or vikasam here is pradhanasya vikasas pradhanasya vikasah when the spread of this pradhanam or prakriti happens maya happens in that state also pradhanatve api yeshah eva sthitah paramatma so he is not uh, you can't give the example of a kulala and a pot and say that the kulala is different from the pot there is no relationship between the two the pot is made up of mud the kulala is not made up of mud tatha tatra kiyan vedah vartate evam bhedah atra nasti because purushah paramatma is kshobhakah he is the nimitta karanam he is kshobhyah he is both pradhanam and jeeva here purusha means jeeva jeeva roopataya api sayeva sthitah and then 
ಪ್ರಧಾನತ್ವೆ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯಂ ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತೆ ಸಂಕೋಚ ವಿಕಾಸಾಭ್ಯಾಂ ಪ್ರಧಾನತ್ವೆ ಸ್ಥಿರ ಹೌ ಡಸ್ ಹಿ ಸ್ಟೇ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಪ್ರಾಸೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಂಕೋಚ ಅಂಡ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಪ್ರಾಸೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವಿಕಾಸ ಸಂಕೋಚ ಇಸ್ ಮಿಯರ್ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಮೂಲ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಅಂಡ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಪ್ರಾಸೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವಿಕಾಸ ಹಿ ಈಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಜಗತ್ ಸ ಏವ ಕ್ಷೋಭಕ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಕ್ಷೋಭ್ಯಶ್ಚ ಪುರುಷೋತ್ತಮ ಸಹ ಸಂಕೋಚ ವಿಕಾಸಾಭ್ಯಾಂ ಪ್ರಧಾನತ್ವೆ ಅಪಿ ಸ್ಥಿತ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ ವಿಕಾರ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪೈಶ್ಚ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮರೂಪಾದಿ ತಥಾ ವ್ಯಕ್ತಸ್ವರೂಪಶ್ಚ ತಥಾ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಸರ್ವೇಶ್ವರೇಶ್ವರ ವಿಕಾರ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪೈ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮರೂಪಾದಿ ತಥಾ ತಥ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಸರ್ವೇಶ್ವರ ಈಶ್ವರ ಸರ್ವ ಈಶ್ವರಾಣ ಈಶ್ವರ ಸನ್ ಸಹ ವಿಕಾರ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪೈ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮರೂಪಾದಿ ವ್ಯಕ್ತಸ್ವರೂಪ ಅಭೂತ್ ಅನ್ವಯ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ತಥಾ ದೇರ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ತಥಾಸ್ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ಇನ್ಕ್ಲೂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ವೆರ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಸಂಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಪುರಾಣ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಗೋ ಆಫ್ ಸರ್ಟನ್ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಅನ್ವಯ ಸೊ ತಥಾ ಎಂ ಪ್ರಕಾರೇಣ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಸರ್ವ ಈಶ್ವರಾಣ ಈಶ್ವರ ಸನ್ ಸಹ ಈಸ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಿ ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾದಿ ಕೀಟ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ಹಿ ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ವಿಕಾರ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪ ವಿಕಾರ ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ವ್ಯಷ್ಟಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಅಣು ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಪ್ರೈಮಾರ್ಡಿಯಲ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪ ಅಣುಸ್ವರೂಪ ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸಮಷ್ಟಿ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ Samashti and Vyashti are two uh, words that you will find in the Vyakhyana often. So the Samashti is, uh, 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 um, that is the best example to, to tell you about Vikara and anu, Anuswarupam is Samashti, so, which is the Moola Karanam for the uh, uh, Srishti creation of the world. Anuswarupancha atra Samashti Rupena Vartate. Samashti to ವನಂ ಇದು ಸಮಷ್ಟಿ ಆರ್ ಜಲಾಶಯ ಸಮುದ್ರ ಇಸ್ ಸಮಷ್ಟಿ ಅ ಗ್ರೂಪ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ವನಂ ವೆನ್ ಐ ಸೇ ವನಂ ಏಕಂ ವನಂ ಅಸ್ತಿ ಇದು ಚೇತ್ ತತ್ರ ಬಹವ ತರವ ಸಂತಿ ತರು ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತೆ ತತ್ರ ವ್ಯಷ್ಟಿ ರೂಪೇಣ ತರು ಇದು ವ್ಯಪದೇಶ ಸಮಷ್ಟಿ ರೂಪೇಣ ವನಂ ಇದು ವ್ಯಪದೇಶ ಯು ಯೂಸ್ ದ ನೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರೀ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಈಚ್ ಇಂಡಿವಿಜುವಲ್ and that is your change that happens to the prakriti prakriti being the mula karanam when it transforms into the different objects of the world that you when you indicate each of those objects of the world it is an individual object so it is a vyashti roopam of maya which is the samashti and it is anuswarupam because we are unable to see it with our practical eye anuswarupam so it is the most subtle form so the subtle forms and the gross elements sthula forms both of these are vishnu's manifested form so vyakta swarupah how do we know about vishnu's swarupam how do we know about parmatma's swarupam he is manifested as manifested with both the samashti roopam vyashti roopam and the samashti roopam which is brahmaadi keta paryantam is that clear hmm. so vikara anuswarupaischa brahma roopaadi bihi tatha vishnu sarveshwara ishwara brahma vishnu shiva rudra ityadaya roopa ityadini roopani santi tasya all of these are called ishwaras but vishnu paramatma becomes the supreme reality who is the sarva ishwaranam api ishwara sa eva ishitrutvat okay because he controls all of these isha uh, uh, ishwaras he is sarveshwaranam ishwara vyakta swarupa his manifest form is this world guna samyat tatas tasmat kshetragnya adhishtitat mune guna vyanjana sambhuti hi sarga kale dvijottama uh, guna vyanjana sambhuti hi guna vyanjanam is mahat so first you have pradhanam pradhanam is your prakriti or maya from the pradhanam when this kshobha kshobhanam happens or when this in the kalakkam undagarche and the gunangalukku 
ರೈಟ್ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯ ಯದ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ತದಾ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ದಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ತತ್ವಂ ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಮಹತ್ ತತ್ವಂ ಆರ್ ಮಹಾನ್ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯಾತ್ ತತ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದೆನ್ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯಾತ್ ಗುಣಾಂ ಸಾಮ್ಯ ಅವಸ್ಥ ಯತ್ರ ವರ್ತತೆ ತತ್ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಸೊ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯಾತ್ ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಇಸ್ ದ ಈಶ್ವರ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಮಾಯ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಇಸ್ ಶರೀರ ಹಿಯರ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಮಾಯ ಆಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಶರೀರ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಜಾನಾತಿ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ದ ಸಾಕ್ಷಿಭೂತ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಹೌ ಗಂಧ ಸನ್ನಿಧಿ ಮಾತ್ರೇಣ ತತ್ರ ಕ್ಷೋಭನ ಉತ್ಪದ್ಯತೆ ಉತ್ಪಾದಯತಿ ತಥಾ ಅತ್ರಿ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ರೂಪೇಣ ಪರಮಾತ್ಮ ವರ್ತತೆ ತಸ್ಯ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಾನ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಾನಭೂತ ನೌ ಸಾರಿ ಸಹ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿತ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ಸಾಕ್ಷಿ ಆರ್ ಪರಮಾತ್ಮ ಸೊ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯಾತ್ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ತತ್ವ ದಟ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಔಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸರ್ಗಕಾಲೆ you have guna vyanjana sambhutihi abhut so guna vyanjanasya sambhutihi utpattihi abhut what is guna vyanjanam gunanam vyanjanam that which manifests the three gunas three gunas are present even in pradhanam but only from the mahat tattvam mahat is also called the buddhi tattvam in sankhya philosophy so it is only in the buddhi that you start realizing that there are three gunas sattvika rajasika and tamasika until then when there is avidya there is no satvikam rajasikam tamasikam if you think of sushupti avastha in the sushupti avastha you don't have the three gunas in its vyakta swarupa in its manifest form so only when it comes to the buddhi tattvam or mahat that is when gunanam vyanjanam bhavati the saji uh, the manifestation of the three gunas happen so ಗುಣ ವ್ಯಂಜನ ಮಹತ್ತತ್ವ ಸಂಭೂತಿ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ಜಾಯತೆ ನೌ ಯರ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಮುನೆ ಅಂಡ್ ದ್ವಿಜೋತ್ತಮ ಬೋತ್ ಆರ್ ಸಂಬೋಧನ ಫಾರ್ ಮೈತ್ರೇಯ ಪರಾಶರ ಇಸ್ ಅಡ್ರೆಸಿಂಗ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಸೊ ಹೇ ಮುನೆ ಹೇ ದ್ವಿಜೋತ್ತಮ ತತ ತದನಂತರ ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತೆ ಕ್ಷೋಭನಾನಂತರ ಕ್ಷೋಭಯಾಮಾಸ ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತ ಖಲು ತತ್ರ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ದಟ್ ಅಜಿಟೇಷನ್ ಯು ಫೈಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಮಹತ್ತತ್ವ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಪ್ರಧಾನ ಗುಣ ಸಾಮ್ಯ ತತಸ್ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರ ಅಧಿಷ್ಠಿ ಮುನೆ ಗುಣ ವ್ಯಂಜನ ಸಂಭೂತಿ ಸರ್ಗ ಕಾಲೆ ದ್ವಿಜೋತ್ತಮ ನೌ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಚಾರ್ಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ದಿಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಟೆನ್ ಶ್ಲೋಕಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎಂಟೈರ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಇಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ದರ್ ಸೊ ದ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಭಾಗವತಂ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಅ ಕಪಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಹೂ ಹವ್ ಅಟೆಂಡೆಡ್ ಭಾಗವತಂ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೊ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಶೋ ದ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ in bhagavatam when you see you will find pradhanam or prakriti maya it gives rise to mahat tattvam and then ahankara is of three types whereas here in vishnu purana he talks of mahat tattvam itself as guna vyanjanam that is it has the capability of showing the gunas hence mahat tattvam itself is of three types satvika rajasika and tamasika Ahankara, hence, is also of three types, Satvika, Rajasika and Tamasika. The other name for Satvika is Vaikarikaha. Vaikarikaha also means Satvika. Pariyayavachi Shabda Eva. Tatra. Rajasaha, it is called Taijasaha. Satu Pariyayavachi Eva. It is not something different here. So, Satvika Ahankara, Rajasika Ahankara and Tamasika Ahankara. Aham Tattva. So, you have the Buddhi Tattva. The moment you have the Buddhi Tattva, you start thinking, I. in a in your uh, uh, in the jiva level i'm talking about the creation here so there is avidya tattvam then you have the buddhi the moment the buddhi comes there is the aham tattvam and then you have the manas indriya etc from the satvika ahankara you have manas and manasaha adidevata tu chandraha tatra chandra devata api tat, uh, devata yaha utpattihi asit tadanantaram dasha devatanam utpattihi these 10 devatas are the sukshma bhutam for the pancha indriya and the pancha karma indriya what is the relationship between the devata and the indriya adal you have the outer shell of an eye i'm i'm taking the example of an eye 
and you can apply it to other examples also, other indriyas also. Now you have the outer shell of the eye. When just the mere parts of the body are present, you're not going to be able to perceive. You need something called the indriya. That indriya is a sukshma bhutam that is present inside because of the aspect of chit. If Chaitanya Swarupam is not there, then you do not have that I, I indriyam functioning there. So then you have the indriya. It is not enough if the indriya alone is present. There are times when the doctor would say, you know, there is nothing wrong with all the functionalities of his eye. The nerves are there, the, uh, this thing is there, but somehow he is not able to see. Devata Swarupam Tatra Vartade. So that Devata activates that Indriya for us to be able to see the object in front of us. That is common for all 10 Indriyas. The first five are Jnana Indriya and then the next five are Karma Indriyas. Uh, we are going to find that in the second uh, Adhyayam completely. So at that point of time, I will explain what are the Jnana Indriyas and what are the Karma Indriyas. Now these 10 Indriyas, to activate these 10 Indriyas, you have 10 Devatas. Devata to Sattvika Rupena Eva. Uh, they do not uh, 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 physically do any activity. It is only these Indriyas that do the activity. Hence, these Indriyas have come from the Rajasika Ahankara. Next is the uh, objects that are being uh, perceived by these indriyas or the jiva, the, those come from the tamasa ahankara. So for the tamasa ahankara, the first creation is the tanmatras and then the bhutani. There is a process even for this and that process will be described later. So the first five tanmatras are there. It is not that the tanmatras came and then the bhutas came. Each tanmatra produced its bhutam and then from that bhutam you will have another tanmatra and then for that tanmatra, you will have a, a, a bhutam, pancha bhutam. Okay. This process is going to be described now. Uh, one minute. I'll go to that. So, pradhana tattvam udbhutam mahantam tat samavrnotu. Huh, okay, Gunavyanjana Sambhutihi Abhut. So Mahatatvasya Utpatihi Ajayata Kada Kasmat Pradhanat. So from the Prakriti, you had the Mahatattvam. What happens to that Mahatattvam? Is it separate from the Pradhana? No. So Pradhana Tattvam, Udbhutam Pradhana Tattvam, Udbhutam Mahantam Tat Samavrnot. It completely envelops or pervades the Mahatattvam. So it is nothing but Pradhanam. Mahatattvam is nothing but Pradhanam. So Pradhanam pervades this Mahatattvam. You'll have to think of it as, let's say, uh, you have a huge uh, amount of dough. You only take one bit and make one chapati. So that dough has pervaded that chapati, but there is also something beyond that chapati as its mula karana, right? So pradhana tattvam is like that and it pervades its uh, karyam effect, which is maha. So udbhutam mahantam udbhutam, uh, uh, it is not manifested. You take it as udbhavam, utpatti, utpannam. Utpannam Mahantam, the, the Mahat, Mahat Tattvam which was created from Pradhana, that was completely uh, pervaded by Pradhana. So Pradhana Tattvam, the Pradhana or Prakriti, huh, Prakriti uh, pervades the Mahat Tattvam. And so Mahan, this Mahat Tattvam is of three types, Sattvika, Rajasa and Tamasa. Sattvika or Rajasa Shaiva. Tamasaha Tridha Mahan. If you take it as Tattvam, then you will take it as Mahat Tattvam, Sattvikam, Rajasam, Tamasamcha, Mahat Tattvam. Then Nabunsakalinga, otherwise you take it as Pullingam. So Sattvikaha Mahan, Rajasaha Mahan, Tamasaha Mahancha. Pradhana Tattvena Samam, Twacha Bijam Iva Avritam. Now, how is this Mahat Tattvam? He gives an example. He says, just as how a Bijam, a seed, is covered by uh, uh, its skin, Twacha, in the same manner, Mahatattvam is also completely enveloped by Pradhanam. Pradhana Tattvena Samam Avritam. It is covered by Pradhana, just as how the skin covers the Bijam. So the Bijam 
if you take a seed it is none other than the skin also included within it there is you can't separate the skin out from the bija then it won't grow it has to be with its outer skin for it to then come out and grow into a tree okay vaikarika staijasas cha bhutadis chaiva tamasaha trividho ayam ahankaraha mahattatvat ajayata अत्र तो महान पुलिंग शब्देन व्यपदेश अत्र तो महत्व नपुंसकिंग सो महत्वा अजात कि अहंकार त्रिविध अयम अहंकार दिस अहंकार इज ऑफ थ्री टाइप अगेन वैकारिक सात्विक तैजस राजसिक एंड भूतादि चमस नौ दिस भूतादि इज अहंकार ओके This is this is the adi for pancha bhuta iti karanat bhuta nam adi hi ayam mula karanam iti karanat ahankarasya bhuta adi hi iti nama. Eta guna bhyanjanam iti mahatkatvasya nama. Tathaiva atra api ahankarasya anyatu nama bhuta adi hi. In the following shlokas, if you find the word bhuta adi uh, contextually, it could mean ahankara. So Bhuta Dihi, the Mula Karanam or the cause for the Pancha Bhutas or Ahankara is of three types, Vaikarika, Taijasa and Tamasa. And this Ahankara came from Mahattattva. Bhutendriyanam hetuhu saha trigunatvat mahamune yatha pradhanena mahan mahata saha tatha abritaha. Just as how pradhanena mahan abritaha, just as how Mahattattva was covered completely by pradhanam in the same manner, महता महत्व सह अहंकार अभी तथा आवृत इट इज कवर्ड कंप्लीटली बै महत्व अहंकार इज कंप्लीटली कवर्ड बै महत्व इन द सेम मैनर एज प्रधान महान यथा तथा हे महामुने सह अहंकार त्रिगुणत्वात दिस अहंकार इज आलो ऑफ थ्री टाइप्स हेन्स इट बिकम्स द हेतु और द रीजन फॉर भूतेन्द्रियाण पंचभूता इंद्रियाण कारणतया वर्तते अहंकार राइट सो फ्रॉम द राजसिक अहंकार यू हैव दि पंच इंद्रिय पंच कर्मेन्द्रिय एंड पंच ज्ञानेन्द्रिय फ्रॉम द तामसिक अहंकार यू हैव द पंच तन्मात्र विच लीड टू पंचभूता नेक्स्ट ही मूव्स ऑन टू द क्रिएशन ऑफ द पंचभूत दीज कम फ्रॉम दि अहंकार नो पंच तन्मात्र did not get created in one go so the next few shlokas are going to be about how each tanmatra gave rise to one bhutam and that mahabhutam gave rise to another tanmatra tatha eva atra srishtikramah bhavet so prathamam tamasika ahankarat shabdah ajayata shabda came out and then from shabda tanmatra these are all tanmatras tanmatras are sukshma bhutam shabda is sound that we hear it is in a very subtle form that we hear it okay so uh, shabda and uh, the the one that brings the shabdam to your ear is an akasha it is a quality of akasham which is a mahabhutam so from this shabda you have the creation of akasham and then akasha gave rise to sparsha sparsha gives rise to vayu vayu gives rise to roopam form form gives rise to teja jyoti jyoti is from jyoti you have rasa and from rasam you have jalam jala gives rise to water gives rise to smell and from smell you have prithivi this is how the creation process happens it is not just pancha tanmatreshu pancha tanmatrebhya pancha mahabhutani udbhutani itina tatra ekaikasmat tanmatrat ekaikam mahabhutam utpanna तदनतर प्रत्येक महाभूताइक तन्मात्र उत्पन्न दिस इज हाउ इट गोस् नो लेट्स लुक एट द श्लोक इट बिकम ईजीयर वन यू हेव दिस चार्ट इन मैंड भूतादि विकुर्वाण सो भूतादि हियर इज भूता कारण विच इज युअर तामस अहंकार भूतादिस्तु विकुर्वाण शब्द तन्मात्रिक ससर्ज शब्द तन्मात्रा आकाशम शब्द लक्षण भूतादि तामस अहंकार विकुर्वाण नौ इट अटेन्स ए चेंज विकार प्राप्नोति 
So vikurvate, vikurvate. So vikurvana, as it attains a change, it produces shabda tanmatra. Shabda tanmatrikam tataha. Shabda tanmatra, he gives the definition of tanmatra later. Uh, so tanmatra na subtle arg. It has only that in it. Tasmin neva matra gunaha vartate shabdaha ityute shabda yeva gunaha tatra vidyate anyat kinchit nasti iti. So shabda tan matra. Shabda tan matra si utpatihi tadanantaram shabda tan matra tu from the shabda subtle element of uh, uh, sound akasham which has the shabda as its lakshanam. The definition of or the guna. Uh, uh, so lakshanam guna both are same a quality becomes a distinguishing factor for an object gunam is a trait or a quality when i say it is a blue book blue is the quality that is present in the book and that blue is a distinguishing factor for that book to distinguish it to separate it from the other books so shabda lakshanam ityukte akashaha anya mahabhutebhyah vidyate iti darshayitum Tatra Akashasya Shabdahayeva Gunaha Vartate Iti Shabda becomes its distinguishing factor to distinguish or separate it from the other Mahabhutas. So Akasham Shabda Lakshanam Kasmata Ajayata Shabda Tanmatrat Sasarja. It was created. Srijyate Sasarja. Check in Karmani Prayogama Hidvani Osikra. Sasarja. Srijate ko sasar jada ne baro. Okay. Shabda matram tatha akasham bhuta dihi saha samavrnoot. Bhuta dihi tamasa hankara ha yatha pradhane na mahatatvam avritam asit. Right? Just as how pradhana had completely pervaded mahatatvam and mahatatvam had pervaded ahankara. In the same way now ahankara, especially tamasika ahankara, pervades shabdam and akasha. So it has the quality of Mahatattvam, it has the quality of Pradhanam also. So in some way or the other, it's like genetic transformation. No? Uh, we have the genes of our father and the grandfather, mother, great-grandmother. So that somewhere that uh, small gene keeps trickling down to how many ever generations there is. In the same manner here also Maya or Prakriti will have its effect into the tiniest of the object that has been created in this world. It is pervading the Shabda Tanmatra and Akasham. So Shabda Matram, Matram Akasham, Shabda Tanmatram, Akasham Samavranot, Bhuta Adihi, Shabda Tanmatram, Akasham Cha Samavranot. Okay. Akashastu Vikurvanaha Svarshamatram Sasarja. So the same trend is followed in the next few shlokas. Akasha Vikurvanaha. As it changes, uh, it creates sparsha, touch. Sparsha matram, sparsha tanmatram sasarja. It creates creates the sparsha tanmatra. Balavan abhavat vayuhu tasya sparshaha gunaha mataha. Abhavatu. Abhavat uh, abhut or uh, uh, udapadyata. The, 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 it, it was created from sparsha. Sparshat balavan vayuhu abhavat. From sparshatan matra, you have vayu which was created, which is balavan, which has a great uh, 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 more shakti than akasham uh, because it has more uh, element. Or balavan in the sense that vayu is the pratyaksha mahabhutam that we can find. Its effect is clearly felt by us. And its guna, its quality is parsha. It also has shabdam. It has the capability of uh, uh, bringing us uh, that sound also. So akasham, if you look at it, it has only shabda. Whereas the next Mahabhutam will have its own special quality plus the quality of the earlier Mahabhutam. Okay? So, Balaman Abhavat Vayuhu Tasya Sparsho Gunaha Mataha. Uh, I'll stop with this. Narayanam Namaskritya Naranjiva Namotam Narotam Devim Saraswati Mbacham Tato Jayam Virayet. Any doubts? Sandarka? Okay.